Welcome back to the Famous Room channel. On last week's Mama Jun family crisis, Jun Shen and ghosted on rehab, leaving her entire family devastated and disappointed. In a sneak peek for this week, the entire family reacts with horror as Jun sells everything she owns and a lot of what they own for quick cash. Late last summer, when this episode of Mama Jun Family Crisis were filmed, Alana Thompson was dealing with a scandal. See, the high school freshman had pretended to snort cocaine on Instagram Live. Between being 14 years old, being a celebrity who grew up on television and her mother's downward spiral and crack arrest, this was serious, and everyone was determined to get Alana to understand that. Being 14, however, Alana does not initially understand why so many adults who love her are freaking out. In this sneak peek, we see Lauren beg her to take this seriously. Alana's manager, Gina Rodriguez, even video chats with her to talk about the seriousness of this scandal. In reality, we know that Alana likely lost some business opportunities because of that. 14-year-old stars are held to lofty standards. Meanwhile, Jennifer Lamb very dramatically shows Mike Sugarbeard Thompson the video of Alana. Now Jennifer clearly loves being on reality TV, and not just because she got a full body makeover. In this very staged looking conversation, she assumes the role of the gleeful villain, encouraging Mike to seek custody of Alana. We all know that Mike was a terrible father and shouldn't have custody of a houseplant, but this storyline looks pretty serious. Meanwhile, Lauren is also taking this seriously, in her own way. Because she and Gina were not able to get through to Alana, it appears that they are staging a mini-intervention for Alana. Nobody thinks that Alana is actually doing lines of coke, but interventions can be for many things. Alana is visibly stunned when she walks into, well, a very polite ambush. The good news is that it appears that this intervention somehow got through to Alana. Maybe they spelled out their concerns, maybe they told her about the professional consequences of being the girl who pretended to snort coke. Whatever it was, Alana ended up weeping. We hope that this was a sign that she got the message, poor girl. Obviously, Alana's acting out, which was genuinely milled, was because of June's own bad behavior. And as the family learns in this sneak peek, June's behavior got a whole lot worse. Last year, just days after Alana's scandal broke, someone recorded the interior of June's damaged trashed house. June was selling off her possessions in a desperate bid to keep Gino by her side, and a potential buyer shared what they had seen with the world. Now, the sneak peek doesn't show all of the details, like the discarded syringes laying around or almost all of the furniture being gone, but it is Lauren's husband, Joshua Efford, who gets to break the news on camera, while, let's be real, Lauren fakes a reaction to news she already knew. Lauren doesn't have to fake her horror at the state of June's house, even more unnerving is that June isn't limiting this fire sale to her own possessions. The crack addicts will steal your stereo trope is so old that it dates back to when stereos were normal household equipment. But in this case, it appears that June was selling things from Alana's room, from Lauren's old room, and even things belonging to Ella. As Lauren and her husband discuss this horror show, Alana listens on. Remember, June was supposed to go to rehab just recently, but ghosted. Alana is having to process how far her mother has fallen. It gets worse than just the trashed house and then stolen and sold items. Yes, when you take something belonging to someone else and sell it, it is stealing, even if it's in your house and even if you bought it. Joshua notes that the potential buyer had also gotten a glimpse of June herself along with a syringe littered garbage heap of a house. And, well, Lauren's face really says it all. Mama June Family Crisis is certainly living up to the Family Crisis part of its name. But fans expecting to see June clean up her act or even return to her starring role are in for a nasty shock, at least this season. Only very, very recently has June Shannon taken steps to fix her life. Fans hope for the best. In the meantime, we can continue to watch the devastating fallout that one woman's choices are having on her entire family. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.